Data isn't just about numbers. It's the untold stories waiting to be uncovered. Imagine wielding the power to turn raw data into captivating narratives that hold the key to better decision. If you're a data analyst or aspiring storyteller, this is where your journey begins. Welcome to the enchanting world of data and storytelling, where you unlock the secrets hidden within the numbers and awakening the storyteller in you. This is Tech Mastery Hub once again. I am Oladeji. In the world of data analysis and programming, data storytelling is the key source that transforms data into actionable insights. It's not about fancy charts alone. It's not about complex algorithms. It's about making your data to come alive. Data storytelling helps you to communicate the ally behind the data and turn it into a powerful tool for decision makers to be able to use. Now, as a data analyst, we know that um, we take raw data, clean them up, process them to meaningful you know, ways as may be you know, needed for what we want to do. We make um, our analysis. We bring out insights. After our findings, we visualize everything to make it easily comprehensible. Now, this storytelling we're talking about is that underlining factor behind our visualizations, behind our insights, behind our analysis that will make it easily comprehensible and very meaningful to the stakeholders we are making them for. What are the key things we need to put into consideration when we're done with you know, our analysis in order to make out a very reasonable data storytelling out of it? When we say data storytelling, first of all, let's understand this. What you have done as a professional will not easily be comprehended by everybody. They want something that will engage them. They want something that will, you know, come out alive to them. But these are mere abstract numbers. How do you get it across to them in a way that easily they comprehend what you're saying? They understand what you're saying? That is what we're talking about when we say data storytelling. Now, one of the first things to take into consideration is the power of context. The first step in data storytelling is providing context. Help your audience to understand why the data matters. Help them to understand what problem it solves. What are the opportunities that it has revealed after your analysis? Context is what sets the stage of your data narrative. Next, let's try and humanize our data. Data storytelling humanizes number. It takes the abstract and makes it relatable. Use anecdotes, use real life examples or relatable scenarios to bring your data to life. When your audience can see how a data impacts their daily lives, it becomes far more engaging, far more comprehensible. Now, use structure and a flow. Just like any good story, data storytelling needs structure. It needs flow. You start with a clear beginning. Introduce your data to them. Build tension with your insights. Provide a satisfying resolution. Structured data narratives keep your audience engaged and make them eager to learn more about what you have done and what is in there from your data. Visuals should always speak. Visuals will aid in everything you do. So let visual aids be your allies in your storytelling, 
use charts, graphs, infographics strategically to complement your narrative. Each visual should support your story. It shouldn't overshadow it. So when you are making those charts, let it be compelling. Let it speak something. It's not just to make fancy out of um, that bar chart or pie chart. Use relevant charts for each insight we're bringing out in such a way that it's going you know, to be compelling. To, it's going to be, make your narrative you know, complete for your audience. However, let's look at it in general picture. Data storytelling can be said to be the missing link between raw data and the meaningful insights you want to get across. It's about turning data into story that resonates with your audience. So whether you're presenting to stakeholders, to team members, to your clients, remember that data has the power to inform and inspire. With data storytelling, you are not just sharing numbers. You're sharing knowledge and empowering your decision maker. That is what data storytelling should be about. Once again, this is your Tech Mastery Hub, and I am Oladeji. If you have enjoyed this today's episode on data storytelling, please share for others to, to see and enjoy too. Like this video, and don't forget above all, subscribe so that as we bring more insightful topics in programming, data analysis, and tech as a whole to you weekly, you will be one of the first to know and learn. Thank you for joining me.